I'm Kelly Brory, and we are going to start trying to do kind of a video thing of our, our racing program, maybe, see if you guys like it. Um, these are kind of the important, these are the important people, not kind of, that are part of it. We got two kids also that aren't here right now. Um, but yeah, we're gearing up to go to Arizona, and I am going to be doing something new this year. I've been in a sock car for, what? 12 years, technically probably if into a normal person season, it'd probably be like six years, half of that, and 10 nights a year, 11 nights a year, not a whole lot, I can't lie to you. I'm her husband, Dan Murray. I started racing when I was 12 in go-karts, the age of 15, I moved up to Sport Mod, raced on and off until I believe it was like 2000. 16, I had a bad accident that took me out for a couple years and then got back into it, ran sport mod again and dabbled the A mod a little bit and then uh, met Kelly who was currently at that time running sport mod. Uh, was having some health issues so I kind of backed off and turned to helping her more than myself. Um, wasn't racing enough so I got rid of my car and uh, Helped her with the stock car, raising four kids and owning a business. And Kelly coaches seventh and eighth grade girls basketball. And we look forward for maybe you guys riding along with us through the deal. Yeah. My name is Joe Schmidt, Kelly's father. I have been racing since 1979. I started in a figure eight race car. Uh, did a hobby stock for a half a year, went full blown right into a modified in Minnesota, so it was a Minnesota modified. Uh, did the modified thing for 15 years. Why I was doing that, Kelly and her brother raced go-karts when they were five, six, seven, eight years old. We took a break from racing. I retired racing in 2001 and uh, a few years after, I think it was 2008, the kids hit me up after taking them hunting and fishing and all that fun stuff. Um, they had the racing bug and wanted to get back into it again. So we uh, built a cruiser car, a two-person seater car, and had a lot of fun with that uh, for two years. And then the stock car rules changed. My son wanted a modified, my daughter wanted a hobby stock. The stock car was the middle contender and with the rule changes it made it easier to switch later on if we wanted a modified versus a stock car. What stock car it was and I used to build cars for a living so the cars that Kelly raced were pretty much all my design, my build from the ground up, motors, everything. I've been doing it for a long time and, and, uh, and then she had a bad wreck in Webster City, a uh, wrecked car. I was fortunate to be able to order a new B&B &B, uh, about towards the end of the season. And from then on, we've been racing somebody else's car that I haven't been building any. But anyway, she raced a uh, stock car since she was 14 years old until now. And uh, she's 27 years old. Hard to believe. We've been doing this for so long as a family. We been all over the United States and now we're venturing to Arizona again. Instead of her husband racing, she's gonna race. And I am gonna race a stock car there. So I've been having a ball racing stock car. And so we just love racing. Our, uh, it'll be Kelly's uncle, his son races. Her uncle used to race modified. So we're definitely a, a family racing organization if you want to call it <laughs> so yeah and now uh, there's going to be some switching of gears and having a great time in Arizona with family and friends You're up. yeah so um this is Riker over here he's seven um his go-karts over there the motor's gonna get rebuilt hopefully he'll get in it and be excited to do it so Maybe we'll have some, some stuff like that. I don't know, you guys will just have to let me know what kind of content or whatever you want and we, we can do it. And if you guys like it, we'll keep doing it. If not, it's 
not going to do it. Um, this is Bristol. She's two. And a half. Two and a half. Advanced list. <laughs> had an accident. Yeah, too many accidents in the shop today. So she doesn't have pants on. And now she carries JJ everywhere with her. So you'll probably see her with JJ. Yeah. What's bad about it? Yeah. A lot of this um, is actually pushed towards we're helping to, we're hoping. It's not cheap for the sponsors that have come abor or aboard um, for this year and they, they dig in their pockets after, you know, with their hard earned money to help us. And we're hoping maybe this will kind of help them out to get a little bit more exposure. It's not necessarily just for us. We were hoping it was just an all the way around good way to get their names out there, maybe get. <clears throat> Definitely for our sponsors, um, we got a couple, three, four new ones this year, and then we've had some that have been with us since I was in the stock car. Um, and yeah, to get some exposure for them, exposure for me and even for the kids um, when they start racing too. So yeah, if you guys like the content and you want to see more, we can definitely do it. But we're going to probably, we got a new car this year, like I said, so... We're kind of all staring at it because it just got it just got wrapped, so it looks pretty. So we can do in like an unveiling or whatever, so we can show you. But I haven't said either what class we've we've switched to, so I won't be in a stock car. So after a lot of years in a stock car and getting better and better, I I was a little leery on moving to a different class. Um, I really am the type of person that wants to be good and win at what I what I was doing before I either moved up or moved down or moved somewhere else. And I had never won in the stock car. I've come close lots and lots and lots of times. Um, but again, to for an excuse or whatever you call it, I wasn't racing enough either. We kind of do, uh, our older boys, they're in sports. So baseball all summer long um, and Rikers in sports and She's not quite yet, but between the business and them doing sports, we like to race once a week, but sometimes it's just not in the cards for us. So, or we can't really race a track consistently to go for like a track championship or whatever, because they got baseball games randomly throughout the week and it's different every week. So we just kind of race when we can. And when we do, we enjoy it and we like doing it. All the kids love going. And so, yeah, I, I don't know where I was going with that, but. The key thing nowadays is we like to travel. We went to Bristol last year, and now we're going to Arizona. Uh, so hopefully, if you guys are liking what we're trying to do here and let Kelly know um, what you want, there is uh, going to be a lot of stuff going on because I'll have my my stock car and she'll have her new hot rod, and uh, there'll just be some neat stuff going on there's always tons of uh antics as you will with uh, poor kids and grandparents and all of us traveling around and father in laws <laughs> <laughs> so yeah hopefully you enjoy it and uh you, the way to make it better is you to let us know we appreciate it you guys like want to see i don't know like our day-to-day -day things like we we own an automotive and diesel repair shop we have a wash bay, um, we have snow removal, we just bought a semi, and we're just jumping into kind of all over into everything. So the racing thing is just kind of a, a fun side thing that we do. Um, the kids are going, I mean, everyday deal, what's going on. And we could literally that morning go to a basketball game, work on the race car in the afternoon, and go wash two semis in the wash bay at night. Like it's, it's all over the place, all over the board. So. Whatever you guys want to see or do, or if they all racing, we can do all racing. But I mean, our lives are hectic; they're crazy. And yeah, it could be sports in the morning, whatever. It's all yeah. So whatever you guys want to see or do, we can definitely do that. But I'm excited to show you guys. We're gonna definitely we'll do like full live. Uh, I don't know when we'll 
lot about race cars. I've been doing it for a long time, but I don't know a lot. So I'm going to be learning and going through like. I'm sorry, sure. that's bullshit. <laughs> I don't. She knows more than she just doesn't know how to spit it out. She can work on it, tear it apart, pull the motor out, change gears, do any service work to it whatsoever. That's one thing I. Don't know where she's going with that, but I taught her <laughs> that she has to work on the race car in order to drive the that race That is car. true. That's, yeah, with the stock car and stuff like the gears. I can give you a hint that the gear thing is going to be way easier on me. That's all I got to say. But <laughs> um, I also don't want to hear about the mustache. It was something new I tried. It's going away. <laughs> yeah, so I don't know. I don't, I, yeah, I, but the car, obviously I'm going to be in a different class, so... Just, I uh, we hope to get some stuff between like the conversations that I have between like Daniel, he's helped me a lot and what dad talks to me about. Like for me to learn the car has been the super hard part and I can, I know the car, but I don't know how to say what's going on with the car to help the people that are setting the car up do what they're supposed to do. And so that it fits my driving or the track, anything really. Yeah, so it's, that's been, We'll do some stuff like that are on the road. We got 24 hours. So we're in Iowa and it's exactly 20, exactly 24 hours to Arizona. So we're going to Central, isn't it called Central? It's Yuma. It's Central, 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 Central Arizona, Arizona Speedway, Speedway yeah. is where we're going to be headed to. They have a four day, four it's day show. It's actually uh, five day with the practice. It's going to be five no. days with us. Yes. But we, because uh, it goes into a second week, but we can only right. attend the first week. We got to get back to the um, work business. And, right. Uh, so, kids, so we'll be there that I'm fortunate to stay down there. I'm staying for a month. So, I'm going to race down there for a month. She's going to race there for four days, but Yuma actually has winter nationals. And so she's going to do the first half of it. And then they got to get home. Yeah, so it's super nice that they actually have a practice session. So in this new car, I'll be able to to get some laps in before we we go racing side by side. So that's gonna be nice. We can figure some things out on the car, get some tires done, give us a day to do some stuff. Um, but yeah, so that's 24 hours. We'll get some. Uh, who knows what we're gonna find along the way? Or we really haven't made travel plans. We just know we're supposed to be there on Tuesday to practice. We're leaving. January 4th. Yeah, so we're leaving the 30th at night to catch them. They're gonna go a little bit earlier and we'll see what we find along the way and we'll try to show them, share that with you guys and just kind of make the trip out of it. Yeah, we gotta stop somewhere for the Hawkeye game, but yeah, we're gonna yeah, make it down the Hawkeye game's on four. Saturday. Yeah. So the Hawkeye <laughs> game sometime on Saturday, wherever state or place we're at. So we're going somewhere with a TV. That's all I know. <laughs> I'm an outsider. Screw you. I'm sorry. No football. No that kind of crap. I, it's racing, racing, racing. Or fishing. She just hit, she, she just hit uh, JJ on the side of the race car. So next time you see JJ, it's probably going to be right. Can I say love you now? Well, we look forward to um, you guys going with us. Like, comment, share, wherever this is on. Um, let us know, comment what you guys want to see, like we've said. Um, I have no idea what my link is on the YouTube. So I'll put it in the comments. So if there's something, or if I share it on our Facebook page, you can go like Kelly Joy Racing. Um, that kind of tells it. I'll try to update that as much as possible on where we're going, where we're at. And then between videos and stuff, I'll try to edit and do as much as I can in between the posts. Um, or to like go Facebook Live or whatever you guys think to do I guess we're kind of open we're new to this we're open to it so so just like share it subscribe on YouTube to it and we'll just, we'll just have fun and go from there so see you on the flip side thank you